Atiku Tobuari, never this bad. Nigeria was the civil war era. Former Vice President Atiku Abubakar has criticized the Buari administration, saying the state of the nation is worse than the civil war era. Even during the civil war, it is never this bad, Atiku told the People's Democratic Party delegates on Saturday in Lagos. Now more than ever, we are so divided because people across this country have been treated unfairly under the current administration. Nigeria has never seen the level of insecurity that we are facing today. I am here because I have the requisite experience to govern this country well and equitable to give everyone a sense of belonging. I am here to appeal to your conscience. You have a historic responsibility to bail out this country, he said. Atiku was in Lagos to seek support following his recent declaration to contest the office of the President of Nigeria. Amid shares and chants of solidarity, Atiku addressed the party faithful, including present and former Lagos State DP, PDP chairman, local government area chairman, youth leaders, and members of the state working committee. While retreating his promise of 40% youth and women representation in his cabinet, Atiku ex expressed his desire to restore a sense of belonging to marginalized Nigerians. Decrying the state of governance in the nation, he urged the party faithful in Lagos to make the right choice during the 2023 primary election of the party by supporting the most experienced and competent presidential contender. He said he has a proven track record of leadership, especially in the area of security, the economy and infrastructural developments. Addressing the youth, uh, the Wari, Wari, Waziri Adamawa said, even during the civil war, it has never been this bad. Now, more than ever, we are so divided because people across this country have been treated unfairly under the current administration. The former vice president, who presented letters of appeal to each delegate, cancelled the youth leaders to seek the progress of the nation and shown aspirants offering to buy their votes. All right, that's just the statement from Atiku. I think in a real sense, Atiku is making a statement which is true about the situation of this country. But my question to Atiku is that he's been there, he has been there for eight years. When he was there, what did they do in their regime? to save this nation i cannot really point out what have been done by their regime i could remember otter road ogun state's expressway to otter the road is still as bad as that even though that road leads to bell university where the former president has his university the road is still as bad as it has been since the Ateno. But it's just unfortunate that all of them, they are the same. They will come up with different promises. Having gotten what they are looking for, they will forget all these promises and the masses until the next election coming up again with promises. They become promise and fail. Anyway, I just pray that God's will will be done at the end of the day. This is my own take, my viewers. What's your own opinion? As regards Atiku's statement, please drop your comment in the comment section. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Thank you and God bless.